Pokemon, Cammy is playing. I am excited. We've been playing Animorphs all night, <laughs> and I'm so happy to be playing not Animorphs. This is kind of like our, our uh, what do you call it, reward? Oh yeah. For enduring the hardest. <laughs> for sure. So what should I lead with? I guess keep leading with Gah. We have Gah. A, we have a, <laughs> Gah. We got a pretty balanced uh, team right now. We do. So this guy broke his back. Hey, it's Kurt. Hey, hey there. Um, oh. <laughs> Guards up top took off when I shouted at them, and I took a tumble. He took a tumble. Slam down hard on my back. Yeah, he can't move. Okay, not to not to cross over series, but how come his scream works and ours don't? Right. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so let's go fight some men. Hey. Dun. Oh my God, it's so good. Wow, a good game. God, good music. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> Woo. I start, so I fell down here. Oh, he's taking out his anger on us. Dude, like my wife. Anyway. Hey. So, so Cam, are you ready for a little history lesson today? Yeah, oh, oh boy, here we go. Alright. So, because I got, because I have, I have a new phone. Oh, yeah, go I ahead. I was able to down, I have my old phone, by the way, not to be super complaining, because I know how your phone, you only have ghost attacks. Yeah, I'm gonna switch. I know your phone's like a half-ass smartphone. Oh yeah, it's right? super old, it's like five <laughs> years old. Why don't you get a new phone? Because I don't want to spend money. That's true. And if you never spend money on stuff, then you save money. Mm -hmm. that's, the, that's the secret to life. That's been money. Because if you spend money on little bullshit all the time, you will not have money. This is a great crossover to our Patreon. <laughs> <laughs> well, no. God, no. Okay, just... <laughs> no, no. Uh, right, so my old phone only had 4 gigabytes of space. And, like, I know it's like, you shouldn't complain about that, but I can only fit about, like, 20 pictures at a time. That's a little annoying. So I got, like, a new upgrade. But with it, it was a lot of space, so I downloaded a bunch of stupid apps. And one of them is something I want to try called Pokemon Duel. Which is, is, is that Yu-Gi-Oh? <laughs> it's not Yu-Gi-Oh, no. No, no, no. Okay, so do you remember... Are there some children's card games happening here? There are motorcycles in Pokemon are there? Duel. Are they playing Pokemon on motorcycles? <laughs> your character has very big hair. There's only three options. Big hair, bigger hair, and, the, and, uh, your and hair, you're, you are hair. Big, big, big pink hair? Green pink hair? Big pink green? Whatever, yes. Pink hair bear? Care Bear Stare. Seth Rogen, get him. So, uh, so, do you remember back in, like, 2003, Pokemon, the trading figure game? Trading fig? Oh, man, I think vaguely. That's what Was there a game that went along with it, or was it just figures? No, it was just a figure game. It had a mat. It was supposed to be the new thing that was supposed to, like, surpass the Pokemon trading card game. Oh, is that was that supposed to be, like, a, like a Warhammer or, like, a Hero... HeroScape, kind where of. it's like they have figures and was it like yes, a board? Yes. Dude, did you ever play HeroScape? No. Oh, Is dude. It cool? Yes, it's Maybe like for Game Boy Color. <laughs> no, it's it's a game like that with like little figures. No. I'm and it, it was like different like. What would be a good way to explain this? I guess almost kind of like like Overwatch thematically. Like it's just a bunch of different heroes and like villains from different time periods. Like there'd be robots and there was a bunch of like um, Valkyries, hipsters, vegans. <laughs> yeah. And there was like, you know, like a would there be a wizard, and there'd be like a mm -hmm. World War II soldier. Yeah, and then. Not use nostalgic kid. <laughs> yeah, you know. Mm -hmm. Weird hippie. All your favorites. <laughs> no, but it, it was like that. You just had like one board, and your goal was to like get to the end goal. And you, like, to attack, you had to like fidget spin. <laughs> oh boy, I didn't just say that. <laughs> didn't mean it like that. Oh, this is where spinner. they invented girl rockets. Yeah. It's always good. They're kind of cute, not gonna lie. Yeah, they're pretty cute. Uh, smash or pass? Uh, Let me see. I'd oh, she's cute. Look at her. I'd smash Jesse. <laughs> That's not Jesse. It's it's a little. Oh no no. It's like the other. Oh gosh. Remember from the anime? Like it was like Butch, and like oh and the other girl. And Cassidy. Cassidy. I was like Cassidy with red hair. It is. Because the. Oh, I, I forgot that they like replaced <laughs> Jesse and James for a little bit. For a couple episodes, they were like. Rivals. They come back every so often, don't they? Yeah, not not in like don't recent it? times. But it was only like I think like a Gen One, maybe Gen Two thing. I didn't watch a lot of the Gold Silver anime. Oh uh, yeah, I didn't. I just watched like the first one when I was a kid. Yeah, the, I watched the shit out of the first anime when I was a kid. Oh yeah, I ran, I That's rented him. I rented VHSs from, from the library. I own those VHS. Oh, I didn't have money, so. Because you, you're spending money, we're saving money. Exactly. No, it's because I didn't have money because I was a kid. Mm. Like if I want, if I wanted like a game when I was a kid, I either had to like a. Wait for my birthday slash Christmas. They're three days apart. That's why I was saving together. <laughs> and nice. right, and then. Or I had to save my my allowance for like <coughs> half a year. Hold on, <coughs> that water went down the wrong hole. You should not try to breathe water. You aren't a fish. <laughs> I should not take water suppository. You are not a fish. <sighs> um, <coughs> go. Anyway, 
Okay. Or I had to go and rent them from a, uh, we had like a little, <clears throat> like, um, family owned video rental place, like Blockbuster, but like, just, cheaper? <laughs> yeah, but no, but she Blockbuster was, was, was super it was called, uh, yeah, it was called Roadrunner, and it had like the little, oh, road, yeah, really? it had like the Roadrunner, like Wiley Coyote. Did they get away with that? I guess Roadrunner it probably, was public domain. I don't think so, really. Well, really? But you always see like those shirts with Bugs Bunny on them, like the really gross like gangster ones, you know what I'm talking yeah, about? Yeah, I think Looney Tunes is public domain. Probably. I wanna say, cause like, they were made in like the 30s, I think. But they are pretty old, 30s? if you think about it. I don't know how old Looney Tunes are, shoot. Hey, g Gay leveled up to 13. What'd you call him? <laughs> gay. Oh. Gay? Oh, oh, like Canadian. Yeah, like gay. Gay? Gay? You gay? <laughs> Bro, you gay? Um... I don't like the way you're talking about me, gay. Eh? Ekans, he's pink. Yes. Pinkins. Pinkles. Uh, stop. <laughs> I got mean look. It's Does it really only have five PP? That's good for the legendary dogs. If you do want... Oh, shit. If you want Raikou, Suicune... Does uh, it freeze him? Ikun. Yes. Oh, my God. And you have, like... I need to keep that move. I mean, yeah, we can if you want to use it. I want Entei. Just Did you time. watch the third movie? Fuck, yeah, it's my favorite one. Me too. Dude, yeah. Dude, yeah. Not the table. <laughs> I said, that wasn't the table, that was some, that was a pro fisting, okay. That was straight Yes, up. the third movie is so good. It's the best one. Pokemon Like, all the crystal three. castle and stuff is so cool looking. Charizard comes back? Yeah! Oh my god, that movie. We he comes on screen and he goes, and they're like, oh, Charizard, I missed you, and he goes, Okay. And then Entei comes on screen, and he's like, I think, I'm pretty sure, I'm gonna check, the next time I'm visiting with my parents, I'm gonna check and see if we still have You're it. still alive. No, when I was a kid, I had that on on uh, VHS. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna see if I still have that, because if so, we're watching that. Dude, totally. It had like the best Pokemon short. No, 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 the best Pokemon short. No, talk. I had one of the best ones. Oh, the, like the beginning one, with Pikachu. Pikachu, Pichu. Yeah. It had the best Pokemon short. Peekaboo. Which one was that? Peekaboo is when they. It's Pokemon Forever's one. They do like they have hide and go seek. Which one was the Forever? Is that the one Fourth with Celine? One. <laughs> yes. The, yeah. Okay. And it's Dark Tyranitar, and he's like super yeah. creepy, and you're like, oh shit, dude. Dude, that that move is what's up. It has. Professor Oak is a kid. Dude, like, okay, Nintendo, like, game movies are actually decent. Like, have you seen the Professor Layton movie? I think there might yes. be more than one. Dude, that's, that's the only Professor Layton thing I've ever been exposed to. Oh, I gotta get you some Professor Layton games. Sorry. You gotta play a uh, Diabolical Box. The music in that game is so good. I mean, oh my lord. Professor Layton. This reminds me of a puzzle. This song reminds me of a puzzle. <laughs> That's, I was thinking the other day, what would happen if you handed Professor Layton, like, a Rubik's Cube? He'd oh, be like, what? well, this is a puzzle. <laughs> <laughs> oh. So, well, that's what this is. Does that, what does that remind you of? It's just, I don't know. It's like this really slow cutscene of him just, like, really slowly just, like, <laughs> twisting it, like, huh. Huh. Click. Huh. Click. Huh. <laughs> <laughs> it's uh, just, like, an hour long. Yeah, it's, uh, like, the yeah. final boss of, like, one of the levels or something. I gotta heal Cupper. Right? I don't know, I never played it, so I just assumed that, like, Rubik's Cube would be a final boss. No, there's no boss. It's like, uh, have you ever played any uh, Ace Attorney games? Nope. Oh my god. My only exposure to you? Ace Attorney is my Who? friend's fan-made game, and it turned me away from the whole series because it was so hard. No, dude. Ace Attorney serious. is amazing. I know it is. I had to get you the original trilogy. Oh, I'm gonna book. I'm gonna eBay buy you so much stuff now. You need to get that. Right. Oh, you just, if you're you just spending get it wrong. money, you're not saving Yeah, money. you can just get it wrong. You just get it wrong. And that's a game where it doesn't matter if you play it on like an emulator. Support our Patreon so we can buy super games for each other. <laughs> <laughs> for just ten dollars, you will make me happy. <laughs> no, you, you don't need to play. Um, like you can. That's a game where you can play it on an uh, emulator, and it's not a big deal at all because you don't really use the, t the stylus like at all. Yeah. It's because originally it was in. I think. Don't quote me on this. Comments. <laughs> um, I think originally the first three or at least two or one. Ace Attorney games. If you say every number, you can't be wrong. Right, we're on <laughs> the Game Boy Advance in Japan, and then when they yes. ported them only finally, they gave them 3D or they gave them DS treatment. Yeah, they did with like the Pokemon uh, Mystery Dungeon games a little bit. That was an interesting one where they had like a Game Boy Advance and a DS version. Mm -hmm. I liked that because I got the Game Boy Advance one because it was cheaper. The DS one. <laughs> But it was like, actually, I think I got the DS one, like, after I got the... I only got the Red... After I played the sequel. Red Rescue Team. That was a good game. It was That's really sad, game. though. Very good game. It was sad. Like, I was like, oh, this is a Pokemon game. It's gonna be fine. Like, end up bawling for minutes. And Pokemon, like, dying. Right. Like, oh. <laughs> oh, and I was... I always remember, for some reason, the one thing out of that game... I didn't play the sequels. The one thing out of that game that stuck with me more than anything was just the image of that Zatu that just, like, stares into the sun all day. You can like see the future or whatever. Mm -hmm. I was like, dude, that was it was so like that was cool. cool. I don't know. Yeah, those are great games. I love them, especially oh, yeah. like the well, it happened like in the first game, 
We're going all, all over with this conversation. We're talking about Pokemon 3000. <laughs> right. Sorry, Pokemon 3. I call it 3000. I don't know why. I thought as a kid it was like Pokemon 1, it's Pokemon been... 2000, Pokemon 3000. <laughs> yeah, Pokemon 2 is 2000 though, right? Yeah. Because it came out in the year 2000. Well, that's the one with the legendary birds, right? That's the one where, where slow, po slow King misses his pants. Right. <laughs> Dude, I've seen, like, it's so weird that, like, I, like, remember all these movies. Although it's kind of funny because out of all the main, like, those first four movies, mm -hmm. the first one is the one I've seen the least. I've it, seen it, but not, like, as many times as the other ones. I might get a lot of hate for this, but I don't think Pokemon the first movie holds up. Yeah. I, I hate to say that. I feel like the nostalgia hype is, like, probably some of the highest ever. There's, like, like, like two things that are super high nostalgia for people is like Pokemon the first movie and Rugrats. Oh yeah. <laughs> like you know how people talk about how much they love Rugrats and you think about it and you're like, yeah, it was pretty good. <laughs> I didn't watch it much when I was a kid, honestly. Oh, Seth Rogen's evolving. Oh shit. Oh, he's, he's gonna turn into Bayleaf. Mardi Gras beans are actually weed. They're actually turning into <laughs> dank weed. <laughs> Go, Seth Rogen. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, they leave. Oh, fucking leave. Oh, weed leaves. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna heal my heal cupperoni. That's a good idea. I'll buy my potions later. A fucking owl. Come and have a go if you think you're owl enough. Alright. Okay. Yep, that happens. So, anyway. But yeah, though, the movies. I don't think the first one holds up as good either. Mm -mm. I remember watching that with my one ex, because she wanted to, like, watch it. Yeah. And. Oh, it has mail. Really? Okay. Uh, um, this is an odd situation. <laughs> Be good and look after the house. With Grandpa and Slowpoke. Love Dad. Aww. He's dead. Yeah, um, a Slowpoke's, like, dead body. <laughs> like, was hey, that a in your Slowpoke. Is that a Strength Rock? Yeah, you have to come back. We have to come back, okay. If you want to What get... do you get? Slowbro. Oh. If you, want, if you want to catch Slowpoke and Slowbro, I think this is the only place you can do it. I mean, that would make sense. If you want it to it's be our designated well. water type. When do we get Strength in this game? You get Strength after the fifth gym. It's not... No, 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 the fourth gym, sorry. No, 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 it's before that, technically. Before the fourth gym. That's not bad. Get, oh, I think you get... I don't remember how this works. Where do you get strength? I think you get strength either in the... Either right, at the Lighthouse buddy. City... You can use Mudslap. I was saying, there's no Levitate. Yeah, but it's not as... It's, Mudslap's really weak, though. It's base 20. Oh, it's base... Peg, Peg is base 40. It automatically does more damage. I thought... It was, when did Mudslap become 30? It was never good. It's always been 20. It's always been 20? It's always My life is 20. a lie. I thought it was 30 for sure. If, if, you would have, if you would have fucking pointed a gun at my head and told me how much damage does Mudslap <laughs> do, I would have said 30, and then you would have put a bullet in my head. <laughs> That's really sad. For some reason, I could have sworn, like, in Ruby and Sapphire was 30. I think it's always been 20. I mean, I trust you Either way more way, than me. You know way more about Pokemon than I Either do. Either way, Peck would still do more damage, or at least equal damage, so it's safe. Is it a normal type in this game, or is it Peck? Flying? Peck's flying. Okay, so it does get stabbed. I think Peck's always been flying. It's Gust that changed. Oh, uh, yeah. Fun fact. Fun fact. Pokemon facts. Oh, boy. Smog. What, what base damage is Smog? Smog's like 20. <laughs> and it's really inaccurate, too. It's a horrible move. I think, by the way, in recent Pokemon games, Poison Gas went up to, I think, like, 90, like, accuracy, which is super nice. Ooh, nice. It was, like, a 75 accurate move just to poison. Yeah, that's not good. It was bad. What, what's Poison Powder accuracy? 75. There you go. Yeah. It doesn't bad. affect Gah. Heh heh heh. He just laughs like that every time he does this. He laughs like Homer. <laughs> yeah, he licks. Heh heh heh. Coughing. Mm. I am a ghost. Homer! <laughs> Mars just kills him, he comes yes, back. Yeah. <laughs> mm. Dead flesh. Mm. Mm. Hunting. <laughs> my wife. Mm. <laughs> mm. Oh, oh. stop eating my skin! Oh god! <laughs> <laughs> Don't have a cow, man. <laughs> god damn it. <sighs> my favorite episode of Simpsons is the one where, where, Mar where uh, Homer commits cannibalism. When does that happen? Um, season 50. Dude. I didn't like watch like Simpsons a lot when I was a kid. I did. Go I didn't. On. <laughs> the one time I ever watched it, I think it was one of the Treehouse of Horrors, I'm not sure. That was my first time too. <laughs> <laughs> no, but it was one of them where like, it might not even be that, but it was this one where they were at this like house that was all automated. Yes, that was the first one I saw! That was the first one I saw too! It was so messed up! And like, it like cuts, it cuts part his of his- head. Yeah, cuts part of his head off! And I was like, oh, hell no! <laughs> I turned it off, I had nightmares for like a month. Oh my god. Really? Yeah, no, it's it's funny though, because that the same thing almost like later in life happened with um with Futurama. Yeah, me too! The first one I watched was the first episode. And oh, okay. It, 
And it was just like, I don't know, the, it's like really, um... Uh... 14. Yeah. It's really 14. It was really like dark, first I guess. Episode? The first episode was like kind of like... We made the suicide booth. Yeah, it was like stuff like that. Oh, that like, like, when I was a kid, that didn't really mean anything to me. <laughs> I was like middle school this age like a little before i started watching like a lot of like cartoons and stuff like older stuff okay or when i saw that and i saw the first episode and i was like eh. and i like, didn't watch it for the longest time and like later in high school i like started watching it again like randomly and i was like oh this is the best show ever and i like <laughs> watched every episode right. what was what was scary about futurama what for me yeah no when i was i was before i even saw simpsons it was on uh, i think adult swim i just turned the tv one night and it was an ep it was the episode where um where uh, Zoidberg fights um, fights uh, Fry like in a crab arena. Oh, wait, oh, and then and then he wins and he cuts off his arm. Oh yeah. And I lost <laughs> yeah. it as a kid and I was just like, this is kind of like I wasn't. It didn't phase me, but I was like, okay. But my mom came in, she saw that, and she panicked. She's like, no, 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 that's for babysitters. You can't watch that. Oh my god. I was like, okay. <laughs> Did I ever tell you when I was a kid, my my, my mom wouldn't let me watch Ed, Ed and Eddie because they said stupid? Really? Yeah, I watched it anyway, but it was funny. I knew a lot of people growing up who wouldn't, their, wouldn't let their... Or, like, I knew a lot of parents. Or I had a lot of friends whose parents wouldn't let them watch Ed and Eddie because uh, they said dork. Yeah, they said, like, like stupid yeah, like, and dork. I don't care. I don't Because it was very mean-spirited. I'm like, it definitely was, but, like, that's what made it funny. I thought it was because it was, like, it was like, a, like a, not a slur, but I guess, like, a, a, a simile for dick. No, it, that's it, what I, heard. I think it was just because it was, like, a really mean-spirited show. But, I, like, that's, like, the point. Yeah, but like if they, if that's what's so good a lot of cartoons Eddie, are like, like like they always get their comeuppance in the end. Yeah, it doesn't matter. It works like it doesn't show it as a good thing. No, and like it shows like when they're acting like idiots, like they always usually. It's funny. It's, it's like Looney Tunes mixed with like a like a like a I don't know slice of life. I don't know if that's the right word. No, it's I don't know. It's just a chaotic show. Oh, by the way, don't go to the left. Don't go there. Don't go to the left. You right. fight your rival. Oh wow! Thanks for. <laughs> I think he already healed you, but I mean, there's no reason not to. And why not? And then I'll buy some potions, then I'll fight the rival. I don't know. If, or should I fight the gym first? I don't know. I don't know if you have to fight the gym first and then the rival, but I know that if you go to the right or go to the left, you fight the rival. But I don't know if you have to beat the gym first. You can try. Let me. I'm gonna buy some potions or something, That's and then really I'm gonna save, and then I'm gonna try to fight the rival. And if not, I'll fight the gym. That's fair. I'll fight Bub Bubsy. Bubs Bubsy. Uh, Super. Go super. Definitely go super. Like, I guess it makes more like sense. Full health at this point, and they're still good later on. This game's pretty short. Is that fine? That's yeah, fine. Three thousand dollars. <laughs> three thousand dollars. Little, little kid so comes in, just hey, give me, give me some drugs. <laughs> three, here's three thousand dollars. Here's also, three thousand dollars. Give me some cocaine. <laughs> <laughs> cocaine. Slams it on the table. There you go. Feed it to your pets. All right, cool. One co. Okay, he starts. By the way, he starts with um. Man, you know so much. I think he starts with Gasly. So I should go Gasly. And lick him? I mean, if you want, yeah. And that's, that... It actually might be a haunter. Look out. <laughs> okay, but still, like, that does stab and super effective, right? But again, he has a haunter. I know that, but also he's a, he's a computer player, so is, he might use something stupid. And, okay. And so I, you, you know what I mean? Alright, so you can try it. Well, we'll try. If not, oh well, then... Wait, no, 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 never mind. Just use Cupperoni. He has Mud Slap. Oh. Well, I guess he has Peck. Okay, you know what? He's only a I'm gonna try Gay. I'm gonna try Gay. Alright. There we yeah, go. Driver battle. Driver. Tell me something. Is it true the Team Rocket has do returned? Believe, do you believe in God? <laughs> do you have a moment to talk about our Lord and Savior? <laughs> it's like, oh, guys, you start running now. <laughs> Into the woods. It's like, you'll, you'll die in there. There's a dragon. I don't care. <laughs> Only he will show you the light. Please come out. Oh, I forgot our, we named question mark, question mark, question mark, because it was honest. Oh, it is a ghastly. Oh, yeah. He's oh, and it's a lower level. I'm going to tank this guy. Let's do it. I'm gonna body this guy. This I mean, man. You, know, you know his entire move pool. Oh. Oh, okay. He was a smart man. What's that sprite? Hold on. Yeah, that, I don't know about that That's sprite. That's a little weird. Um, can I sleep him? Hypnosis. Remember, Get has pretty good accuracy or a pretty good record with sleep. Oh, oh. Oh. Let's hey, go. accuracy. <laughs> there you go. Smoke screen. He's got. He's gonna hit. Yeah, he <laughs> got it. Yeah, dude. Yeah, but seriously, switch out. This is oh yeah, yeah. We're gonna go to <laughs> Cupperoni. Yeah. Why do we have nothing strong? <laughs> We'll just, we'll just peck him. We have nothing strong. Think about it. He's asleep. It's okay. We have nothing strong. If you think about our team right now. We have five super potions. We're fine. Should I mud slap? Yeah, if you want. You should make him miss. This is where this is where mud slap's good. That's true, actually. If they're asleep and you just want to lower their accuracy. It's kind of like when you confuse a Pokemon 
and then you put them to sleep. Right. And then they wake up and they're still and confused. They're still confused. That's horrible, dude. That's the worst. It's so the weird. fact that confusion doesn't count as a, like, a, a status st yeah. is bullshit. It kind Cause, of is. Because it's like the worst one. It's, is it, it's because it can be healed just by like switching out. Right, but still, like if you put them to sleep or paralyze... Wait, can, can you not switch on paralysis? No, I'm thinking of the card game. Okay. <laughs> um, oh, by the way, I think they changed that. Really? Wait, no, no, no. They, they, well, you can do it with items, but you can't do it with just like standing retreat. That's confusion. Confusion? In like the first few generations you flip, of the right? game, yeah, you did flip to retreat. You don't have to do that anymore. So you can just retreat. Yeah. Oh, thank God, that was always so annoying. Yeah. I remember a lot of people would try to like run decks just to get confusion. Yeah. Uh, the other thing I was gonna say though, um, in recent Pokemon games, they've acknowledged how terrible uh, Parafusion is. So they made Thunder Wave 90 accuracy, just to like spite people. Oh, that's funny. <laughs> and uh, Confusion's one in three chance to hit yourself. Just oh. use Peck; it's stronger. Okay. He's pretty inaccurate. Shut up. <laughs> that one doesn't count. It's okay, I still got Super Potion. We got Sheets. Yeah. We got Shets. Yeah, I'm gonna heal him. Yeah, the Pokemon competitive scene. Arc Switch. Healthy. Pokemon what? Competitive scene is generally healthy. I mean, like, I say that, and like. The and last... then something bad's gonna come out. No, 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 just like the last, like, like national tournament I saw, the, the two, uh, uh, the two people who were, like, like for the finals, mm -hmm. had four of the six same Pokemon. <laughs> Dude, that, that's you're talking to a Yu-Gi-Oh player, okay? But it's like, no, I know, but like, but other than that, I think it was just, it might just be like a meta thing. That's why, I mean, I guess it's always a meta thing. No, that's like the thing that, <laughs> Never mind. the thing that's out right now that everyone hates is a deck called Zodiacs, which are like oh boy. furries, and they're all, that's yeah, they're all based on the fucking, like, Zodiacs, whatever. Mm -hmm. <laughs> there was an event that I saw on YouTube with a thing. The top eight decks were all Zoo. Every one. That's pretty With, like, very similar yeah, deck lists. was not that bad, but still. Yeah. Well, it's because they actually give a shit. Yeah. You know, I started this episode talking about Pokemon the training figure game, and we're ending it talking about... Talking about the training card game? <laughs> this is just all, this is all yeah. over the place Pokemon. No, but the thing basically... No! Uh, no, I think you still got this. Yeah. Yes. No, the thing I was going to say was, uh... Basically, they put the train because the train for your game sold so poorly and it was really hard to manufacture. Mm -hmm. They just stopped making them. But now they have the app game, so it's like that's cool. So it's cool, yeah. And it's still pretty like RNG based, but like it's still like fun, I guess. Yeah, we gotta play Heroescape or something. It sucks though, cause I was th I've been thinking about this every so often. Is I'm like, still like a thing right now. I I don't know. I'm sure you could find like buy older ones on eBay, but like uh, I don't know if they're still making it. Um, Probably not. I, I don't like, think I like so. Fear games went out of fashion. The only thing that's really big still is like um, Warhammer, but you make your own stuff usually, or just like buy them. That's cool. Okay. <laughs> that was weird. <laughs> but yeah, like Warhammer, you just make your own stuff. Um, the game got really upset for saying it's like you. You want to play Warhammer? Really? Are you sure? Um. Is your virginity on the line? <laughs> really? But <laughs> no, for Hero Escape, like I keep thinking about like, oh man, it'd be really fun to like, you know, really like nostalgic to get like one of those and like, you know, we could like play it or whatever. Uh -huh. But like. At the same time, I'm like, I don't want to look and see it be, like, really expensive or something, you know, like, <laughs> like it went up in value, like, horribly. Oh, Zubat, you got this. Yeah, um, because I remember, like, when I was a kid, there was, like, a, a main starter pack. It was, like, a huge-ass thing that I got for Christmas one year. Oh, and you had, owned this? Yes, that's why, that's why I'd be nostalgic. Oh. Yeah, and it was, like, the whole thing was set up, like, uh, hexagons, I want to say? Or maybe octagons. I think hexagons. And it was, like, hexagons, sh sh like, little... Places for him to move on. You can like stack them up to make like mountains and make. Oh different... yeah, that sounds familiar. Yeah, it was fun. It's pretty neat. Was it one of those games that where you didn't actually play it? You just played with the action figures. <laughs> no, I usually knew how to play stuff when I was a kid. Like the Pokemon trading card game. Everyone in my school did not know how to play it except for me because I played the Game Boy game. Everyone in my school knew how to play. Like here are the two things people knew how to play: <laughs> Yu-Gi-Oh and Beyblades. <laughs> They probably didn't actually know how to play Yu-Gi-Oh, but yes. No, but like... They probably knew the I'm 12. Oh, I summon Ixodia. <laughs> I summon Blue Eyes. I summon Blue Eyes. Tributing what? <laughs> <laughs> and I also summoned my other Blue Eyes. Gosh, my whole deck's Blue Eyes. Also, I drew these myself. <laughs> yep, that sounds about right. Yeah, that's, that's the, the I'm 12 method. Dude, how come, how come Seth Rogen's leaves actual quick rolled up blunts? I know, and he's smiling <laughs> too. He's like, hey! <laughs> <laughs> I killed the zoo bat, dude. Oh, fuck, dude, I killed a bat. Dude, I'm gonna, Shit. dude, I'm gonna eat him. Give me money if I eat him. Oh fuck. <laughs> I'm, like, I'm gonna fuck this dead bat. <laughs> oh shit, you, you ready to record it? Oh shit. Put it on Snapchat. <laughs> I hate the week. 
Well, you hate yourself then. Oh, is that his beach your Cut ass? my life into pieces. Yeah, he's so edgy, dude. He's the worst rival. I like him. I don't. Okay. I like May. She's a babe. That's different. That is... Yeah, you're right. She's not a rival. Have you noticed they've gotten friendlier and friendlier each They game? have. Like, Gary was a douchebag. This guy's really edgy. And then May's like, hey, how's it going? Okay, May no, and Gary, Brandon. Gary was fine, actually, when you think about it. And then May's like your friend. And then the fourth game, you have a friend. And the fifth game, you have, like, two friends. And new game, everyone's your friend. What about, oh, what about mind, Guzma? Oh, never mind. They have, never mind no, no, never mind. They have... I think his name's, like... In Sun and Moon, I think his name's, like, Gladian or something. Everyone loves him. GLaDOS. Right? Yeah, something like that. And he's always like. I don't know. <laughs> Some of those people just need to. They just need to get pop one. No, they just need to pop one in the pussy. Ex yes. Okay. They just need to fuck someone <laughs> and just relax. Some like. Just, if just they like, called me up, I'd do it just to let them chill. Okay. Because some pe pe people, they're just way too. <clears throat> and they just need to. They just need to have. Next time on Pokemon Gold, they just need to get fucked. Kami fucks. And then be, they'll be fine. Can you fuck Professor Oak? You met people like that. As a kid, time traveling. You yes. 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 Where they're just like so obnoxiously horny all the time. And I'm like, I just want someone to sleep with you so you fucking chill. Me. 